Polite Expressions Mastering the Art of Asking for Repetition Hello, language learners. Welcome back to our series on Conversational English. Today, we are delving into an essential part of conversation strategies, asking for clarification. Specifically, we'll be tackling asking for repetition, which, believe me, can be done with grace, respect, and, most importantly, politeness. Let's get started. You might wonder, why is it important to ask for repetition? In our journey to become fluent English speakers, we'll inevitably encounter moments where we don't quite catch what someone has said. It could be due to a variety of reasons. Maybe the person spoke too fast, perhaps their accent was challenging to understand, or maybe the environment was too noisy. Rather than pretending to understand or ignoring what was said, asking for repetition politely allows for effective communication to continue. Remember, asking for repetition is not a sign of weakness. It is a sign of active engagement in the conversation. Here, we will discuss some common phrases you can use when you need someone to repeat what they've said. It's all about phrasing your request politely. Here are a few examples. 1. Could you please repeat that? A very straightforward yet polite request. 2. I'm sorry, could you say that again? This is another polite way of asking for repetition, adding, I'm sorry, to the sentence to express respect. 3. Pardon me, I didn't catch that. Could you please repeat? Pardon me, is a very polite way to begin your request. Remember, the key to all these expressions is the tone of your voice. Keep it friendly and polite. It's not just about knowing the phrases, it's also about knowing when and how to use them. You should use these expressions immediately after someone says something that you don't understand. Don't be shy about it. Here are a few examples. Example 1. A. The cat's pajamas is a phrase from the 1920s. B. Pardon me, I didn't catch that. Could you please repeat? Example 2. A. The train leaves at half past 2. B. I'm sorry, could you say that again? Always remember, the other person will appreciate your efforts to understand them correctly. So, don't hesitate to ask for repetition. Well, there you have it. Now you're equipped with some polite phrases to use when you need to ask for repetition in English. Remember, these phrases are meant to help you keep the conversation flowing while maintaining respect and politeness. The key is not to be afraid of asking for clarification. Everybody needs it from time to time. I hope you found this video helpful. Keep practicing, and you'll master these expressions in no time. Happy learning, everyone!